In this video, we will connect an XGB PLC to an operator interface using the Modbus TCP protocol on an Ethernet connection. The connection and configuration principles are similar for any operator interface to an XGB PLC. When connecting a PLC and HMI, the proper protocol and communication parameters must be the same on both devices. Correct network connections and practices must be observed. In this example, we are using an XGB PLC and iView operator interface. The electrical connection is Ethernet. The XGB PLC will be set up to communicate using the XBL EMTA Ethernet module using XG5000 software. The CPU Ethernet port on the M-Type and U-Type PLCs are configured in the same manner. Select the communication port for configuring by double-clicking. The port is XBL EMTA. The station number is 1. Select Auto for media speed. Populate the network setting fields for the PLC. Select Modbus Server for driver settings. Click Modbus Settings and assign the Modbus addresses to the PLC addresses. Click OK. Leave other settings at default. Click OK and write the project to the PLC. The XGB bit and word addresses are now mapped to the shown corresponding Modbus addresses. The IMO IVU operator interface is configured to communicate with the PLC. From the link selection, add a link and the add link window will open. Name the link. The link type is Direct Ethernet. The link device is Modicon. The protocol is Modicon Device Slave TCP IP. Link port is Ethernet 1. Sublinks are only used for multiple PLCs on the HMI. Select the Parameter tab. Populate the IP address assigned to the PLC. The default Modbus TCP port is 502. The node address is 1. This is the station number assigned in the PLC setup. Click OK. Compile the project and download to the HMI. The XGB PLC and iView operator interface are now configured to communicate on an Ethernet network using Modbus TCP. For additional information related to the XGB PLC family of products, visit the links below.